Um, I'll be doing that um today. All right. So, hi everybody. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So, hi everyone. How are you doing today? How was your day? My day was stressful, plenty, and that's not even ended yet. Does anyone want to tell us how today went? Let's just this one. I speak. I know that. Except enough. Yeah, I'll be preparing. I'll be preparing lunch in a few minutes after this call. So that's how my day has gone. No, we, your we network. Can't hear you. I'm seeing network bandwidth. Bandwidth, sorry, is low. My... And somehow you were throwing shit. <laughs> we can't hear you, Enoch. We can't even hear you. This life. <laughs> this All life. Right. Dad, would you like to share your screen, um, so that yeah. everybody can see? It. Um, the doc. All right. Problem. Uh, work. I'm sharing the doc. You know where you can see my screen, guys. Yeah. Okay. Ah, please tell us your name and your most favorite playlist. You ain't no get playlist. How are we going to do this now? Some of us <laughs> don't like listening to music, Sha. I just didn't tell you. <laughs> hey. So, anyone except you no know, bad network. Anyone? Does anyone want to like? Go on and tell us how they are doing. Just one person. Please tell us something positive. Mm -hmm. Let's do that. I think uh, you can tell us that, you know, something, something, something happened. You did not cash out. Suddenly, you're not earning any dollars. And you now say, oh, today is the day that you're going to spoil everybody in chaos. And you now hmm. say, the least one, one K dollars. Let everybody a whole body. <laughs> I think it's open source moon. You get. You Thank now come you. We'll now have our own mini outreach. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, oh, yeah. Chidalu. I am very happy for the accolades. <laughs> uh, I'll let you know in the next meeting. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so since you belong to go, you belong to talk, let me just say how to be with you. I did not do anything to do. I didn't really do anything important. I stepped out though to go and finish up like work, but it was stressful. It was the place was just really uncomfortable. But Sorry we thank about God. that. I am back to my house, safe and calm. Yes. Now let us get to the agenda. I think. Uh, where's the this thing? Okay, you really want taking notes, yeah? Yeah. Okay, so do we have newcomers. Do we have newcomers now? Miss? Sorry, you. I'm the I'm the normal noise maker, the chaos noise maker. Like the newcomers, take take notes. Anytime you hear my name, just know that it's noise. <laughs> 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 you come and say hi. Let us welcome you. Let us give you that chaotic welcome. You know, you know how to be a bee. If you say hi all the time, if you dash you something, so say hi, say hi, hi. say hi. Ah, you will be fine, no, Enoch. If that was you, you will be fine. Hi, my name is Hamza. Okay, hi, Hamza. It's Hamza. Hi, good evening. I, I still consider myself as a newcomer because it's, it's not up to a year since I joined the chaos community. It's just three months. Oh, so uh, for the first three months, I've been diving around all the chaos meeting, uh, looking to searching for a place that I fit. Uh, and I'm very happy that I find a project that I am that is relevant to my skin and I am able to contribute to that project, which is they just concluded the GitHub Copilot Hackathon project. I'm really call that I reach out, which is I I really enjoy the project because along the way I learned something new, which is the uh, Tailwind CSS. Which apart from the name, I've never touched. I've never make any anything with Tailwind. So I I don't know. Was it a Mary Blazing or someone else in the other meeting? Uh, she recommend. Uh, uh a video on youtube which i which really helps a lot to grab something from the chain and contribute to the project so uh, i live in kano nigeria that's where oh. i born. that's where i was born and rise up yeah very far away from lagos <laughs> i'm not in lagos now. and uh, really yeah easy. and uh and uh, I'm, uh, I really like open source, the community, the projects. In my own leisure time, not 
not even uh, I don't even wait until it's October before I start uh, browsing GitHub and then check for uh, particular issues that is relevant to my skin, then I contribute to that. To be honest, I com I uh, contributed to a lot of projects that I can't even recall that I contributed to until I go to my profile and look at the graph again. Then, like, oh, yeah, I contributed to this project, this particular one. And then, by the way, I am also uh, the chapter lead for Open Source Community Africa here in Kano. I've been to oh, Lagos nice. for uh, Oscar Fest 2021, yeah, the post COVID Oscar Fest. So I think that's pretty, pretty right. much it. Welcome, welcome, Hamza. Thank you for that introduction. Thank you, thank you. All right, just later you meet at the Inca or give me blessings on this call, meet as well. They'll give you all those. Um, Newcomer, you are welcome in the Lord, kind of in the name of the Lord, kind of gives you pain or something like that. But you're welcome, you're welcome, you're welcome, you're welcome. Is there any other person? Is there any other person here? Any other newbie? You are sharing out this now. I'm sharing this. You just should start off with it. All right, in the absence of that. I guess we can move on to the next uh, this thing, the next topic in the agenda. The topic. Developers focus group of this. Uh who's going first? Who will be going first? And I'm guessing uh which people? Uh, uh, I, I, I I think yeah. um Enoch. I think we should try to Enoch to, to give us what the yes. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, Someone is um uh, someone is having background noise. Probably they're not muted. Um, there we go. Yeah, you can check that out. Um, nice to see you here, everyone. Um, good to see. Uh, I think I bumped into Hamza during Oscar Fest. I can't tell. Oh, good to see you here. Um, uh, also, I'm not sure how many focus groups should give um updates. Oh, sorry, it's one focus group, the developers focus group. I saw like a, a bureau somewhere. Um, so last time when we met, I think it was clear to everyone that we wanted um, the people that were listed in the project managers um, project to meet so that they polish up some projects in order to make them ready for development and also contributions and also to onboard maintainers who we're supposed to maintain those projects. And I should successfully say that we've managed to at least meet with the maintainers of the budging board, the board script, and also partly the budging website. And we've made cleanups to all those repositories apart from the pull requests that are still open in the budging website. So, um, I should say, if you are on this call and uh, you were selected as a maintainer in a meeting that I don't know, but at least I have a copy, I have access to the Excel sheet that shows the different maintainers for the different projects. If you've not had chance to meet, you can uh, send me a DM or you can tag me anywhere on Slack so that I can put you up to speed with some of the projects that are happening in chaos. There are those that I maintain, and there are those that at least I know the workings of, and there and the rest at least I can point you to the lead or to the maintainer of that project so that you get assistance there. Uh, if if Adinka, you could pull up that spreadsheet and attach it here, it would be good for people to know who to contact and when to do that. But I should say, if any of you scrolls to, if any of you has chance to go to our repositories in the badging, oh, sorry. I was interrupted by a call there. If any of you has chance to go to the repositories in the badging, uh, in, in, in the badging organization on GitHub, and also, also Adinka, if you could 
think I think you need to put a lot of links in here. I can help you on some of them so that uh, people can access them easily. Um, just so that at, at least I have access to them faster. So um, we have three. We have three. Three projects so far that have been. Uh, I think you will you will you will format this, but I'm just placing them here so that people can can navigate there when they want to. They will have the budging board. Okay. Copy. And then lastly, we have the budging website. Oh, I think it's only budging, budging. Okay. So that is all. Those are the, so all, all issues that are in these three repositories and are open are ready for contribution. I'm not sure. I thought on this call, we would have Ruth tell us um, how we are going to navigate the Hacktoberfest, but mostly I was walking around the club with other maintainers to make sure that at least by this call, we have polished up all those repositories and we can welcome new contributors. So I do not know how the logistics and also, uh, I don't know how the logistics of the Hacktoberfest work and how people sign up and how they get to contribute and be recognized. But um, maybe if anyone on this call knows how you can tell us, but mostly the, 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 the issue as to why we were so fast on cleaning up these repositories was to make sure that we're ready for the Hacktoberfest contributions. And um, on top of that, as I heard, and I want to confirm, there will be weekly calls that are going to be happening every Thursday. And I want to put that, I want to share. Oh, I can't share that. So if you go to your calendar, the chaos calendar and you check on Thursday, there will be always on Thursdays an agar call specifically for development in agar. Uh, it will be focusing on APIs, uh, developing agar APIs. So I hope if you are interested in also uh, learning uh, the, de the, the, the developments around Agar more so Python. I, Agar has a front end which uses Vue.js. Also, it uses some other technologies like um, uh, Redis, RabbitMQ, uh, GraphQL, um, Postgre. PostgreSQL database. So it's a whole packed other dimension of the chaos. Oh, it's the whole other packed dimension of the chaos, um, of the chaos, of the chaos, uh, part of the development. So if any of you has, has interest in, uh, Aga, you could join in on those calls. You check your calendar tomorrow. My time shows 6 p.m. You could be in a different time zone as for now. Um, unless there are issues on unresolved on unresolved issues and unmatched pull requests, but at least for now, we're making sure that we are attending to every open pull request and to every open issue. At least um, for now, the only repository that has issues is the, the budging website. And it only has issues with the pull requests. So um, I guess that is all. I didn't want to go into the specific issues of, um, of uh, what is involved in those issues and stuff, unless there is a question about someone who wants to understand particularly any anything in those repositories. I could also just put here the agar, the link to the agar repository for those of you who want to navigate and also the documentation to agar so for those who want to access agar it is there and the documentation 
is also on this link that I'm going to share. So, yeah, that's all um, I should say. I'm dedicated to helping anyone here as long as I have the time to do so. If you're having trouble and issues in navigating your way throughout any of these projects, um, if I do not have the right information, I will definitely point you to someone who has the right information. But don't be intimidated about making contributions or asking because at least I'm sure I've been checking my notifications when I have the time to and I've been making sure I create time and attend to at least everyone. And in case I can't, that's the reason as to why maintainers were put on every on every repository and project so that people can have access to can have access to people that can help them or can have access to people that can help them navigate their way throughout those projects. So that's all from me about our focus group. Probably in the next meeting, we may have now um, updates about new developments in each of these projects. I think it will be good to meet with the maintainers so also separately so like we I did. My computer right now. I was about to take my bath. Let me call you back in 10 minutes. Oh, I thought that was a reaction. <laughs> Um, we, 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 we're trying to see how, because, because after these open issues, of course, the projects should continue growing and we're trying to see with the maintainers, probably on the future calls, how we continue making these projects grow bigger than they are so that we continue accommodating contributors to these projects. Yep, I'm done. Um, thank you for, unless there is clarity, but I'm done. Sidalu, are you still there? Hello? Okay. Okay, so I'm trying to drop um, the meeting link for pressure. Peculiar as hacks. Okay. Um. Let me let me um stand in for Chitalu and see if she can speak. All right. Does anyone um have any question? I know. Yeah, probably if anyone has questions on any mm -hmm. of um, the issues they've been facing in uh, trying to come around any of these projects, um, if we have some good time left and there is nothing else on the agenda, we could focus on those specific questions and try to help them around because mostly that's the use of this call in case there are no other issues, pressing issues on the agenda. Can you guys hear me? Yes, we can hear you now. Oh, okay. I was shouting. Oh my god, can you people hear me? Can you people hear me? I was even thanking Enoch for this thing. Asking him if uh I wanted to know when he would be available because I know we're not done with the badging um website. I wanted to know when he'd be available for us to like complete the peer pull request reviews and all. I, I suggest I suggest since tomorrow I am my Thursday is a little bit free. You could suggest a comfortable time for you when you think you can be able to meet. I uh, we could okay. see whether it works for me. But please, you can suggest any time during uh, as long as it's not beyond um, that is uh, three p.m. West African time. All right, no problem. That's fine. I'll I'll send you a DM. Oh, check. No problem. Yeah, thank you.
Thank you so much. And I think on this call, okay. on this call, I'm seeing Rhoda. I'm forgetting what her inquiry was some time back, but at least we had a chance to talk over the DMs and um, she was trying to inquire something about something. I can't recall what it is, but if she has a chance to speak and uh, make the inquiry again, we could address it from here, unless I really resolved it. But I think I sent her a link to join one of these meetings sometime back. Okay, okay. No problem. And then also, um, I think peculiar, peculiar, you had some inquiries. Country call what they were specifically. And I hope you are able to navigate around those blocks that you had because I think we were on a call previously trying to work our way around some stuff. And um, also some people that are not on this call and they're taking up some issues that have already been assigned to them, please make sure that um, at least you create a draft PR for a particular issue that you're working on so that if someone else is interested in the issue, it doesn't look like you're not working on the issue. And every time you place a pull request, be um, make sure you you tag you attach the issue that that pull request is solving for, so that we're sure there is um, progress on that particular issue, in case you take it up. So um, for the rest that still want to contribute, um, there are a lot of open issues in all the repositories I've listed down there, in all those four repositories. Hopefully by next week, we shall also be adding on the project budging repository. I was meeting um, the dev team earlier and they're almost done. We were just polishing up and doing some maintenance work in some things. But um, as we've been discussing with other stakeholders, this project is going to go open and uh, it will be fun to contribute depending on how much work there is to do. Okay, thank you very much. Hello. Enough. Uh, uh, this is Hamza speaking. Uh, I do have a question. You know, Mike, check one, two. Can you hear me? Yes, yeah, yes, you can, you, you can go on. You can go. Awesome, awesome. So, uh, you mentioned that uh, when when an issue was assigned to you and you are working on it, you should create uh, a draft for that uh, for that issue to make in order to for the maintainers to be aware that yes, we are working on it. And then uh, later on, you mentioned after submitting your PR and then you tag that issue. So uh, starting with the last one, so uh, how can I tag an issue? Was it after sending the PR, then I will just uh, add the issue on on my uh, PR comment or on the issue comment. It's the, it says, um, okay, okay, okay. Um, let me first answer that one. And I'm trying to, I'm trying to see how, oh, I cannot start screen share while other participants in sharing. Could you just give me um, some, it's best to share this adding. Um, Chidalu, please could you stop sharing your screen? All right, no problem. Chidalu, I thought it was you. Okay, I awesome. I think I wanted to share just I Okay, it's not giving me an option to share only a window, but let me just do this. So, um, let's 
So in case you okay. Um so in case you are to work on a particular issue, assuming uh assuming you're working on such an issue, um when you create a pull request for this issue. Right now, there is only one pull request, and I want to use it as an example. On your right here, there will be there will be something like uh, development. So you can always just come here and search for what issue you are trying to solve for. So in case in in this case, if I, for example, there is create a public log. So if I have my pull request already here, I can just come and on my right here, I click on development and search for it here. And when I click on it and remove this, it will it will get linked automatically. GitHub will do that for you. And even down here in the conversation section, you will, when I go back to issues, and check in the conversation section, um, you will see that this has been linked to a particular pull request. And I, if I go on to here, you can see on your right that there is one linked pull request. And most times when I've linked a pull request here, when I merge it successfully, it will automatically close this issue. So that's one other good thing about linking. Uh, but also for collaborative purposes, it helps to for other people that would want to take up the issue to know whether someone else is working on it. And um, when I talked of a draft pull request, uh, it's always advised that if you're working on something and it's really taking long, you submit a draft and you can always you can always you can always put put the word, I'm sorry, I'm playing with someone's pull request. I don't know whose it is. But you can put something here at the start like that, or in small letters, um, something like draft. So if it's taking long and you've not really been able to work on it and finish it in the shortest time, you can just submit a pull request and it stays there and you continue pushing to that pull request. You continue pushing commits to that pull request or even amend previous commits. You can have one commit and continue amending it or even push on the previous ones. And that helps if you are, if you even need feedback from someone because sometimes you may run into an issue, but if your pull request, if the changes in your pull request are already um, put up on GitHub, you can just tag someone whom you think can help you on that particular issue, and they can be able to look into your code, other than the code being on your local machine, where someone cannot be able to see it and also advise. Because here, when the pull request is already here, I can be able to look at it and even go to check files that have been changed so far. And you never know, you may be already having a wrong approach to something and I can comment on it there and then. So while you're working, you can be sure that you're getting uh, feedback while you're working. So it's mostly advised you do that in case your pull request is taking long or in case your solution is taking long. So that's what I wanted to share, to, to show Hamza. Uh, thank you very much for the elaboration. Now I have a clear picture of all the terms. Thank you very much. Sure. You're welcome. Any other inquiry about anything? Um, mostly to help people around here to have their way around any of the development stuff going on. In chaos, chaos Africa. We still have some minutes, I guess. Yeah. 
Okay, um, there is some other thing actually, um, I'm forgetting to point out. Uh, these pull requests, if you go, we're trying to see how we can label them so that they are, so that they easily make sense. For example, in the budging board, we have issues that are even related to documentation. So you don't need to be a dev to, to contribute. We have issues related to documentation. If you look at the tags here, and we're trying to output some tags uh, like good first issue. These October first issues just we've not. Guys, my this Zoom likes crashing. That's why I hate using Zoom for. I like using the browser Zoom. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, I was... yes. Zoom, Zoom. There is a toxic relationship between Zoom and Chaos. Yeah, so it's, just for it's not just for me. And there are some, uh, it's almost the same yeah, on my own end because there are some certain buttons that I definitely know when I click them, Zoom will always crash. I ask again, are you people sure it's not just you people? You know what they used to say about men and being scums and saying, you know, I cannot do it. I just, not like I'm saying it, though, but like, you know, you know, I actually just do you people. Sir, hmm. okay, oh, you know, as you were saying, sorry, don't let me interrupt yeah. you. It's okay. I was just trying to imagine how we're in a toxic relationship with Zoom. And we cannot run away. So um, for those of you who would want to participate in some other things like documentation, and uh, for those of you who are like you think you cannot contribute to open source yet, there are just good issues you can tackle here. I think um that will be the same case we It's just allow me connect to Zoom via my browser because make sure you cannot, always update your Zoom. I cannot can. So frustrating. Now. Okay, so while we wait for um, Hinoch, I would just like to chip in this. We'll be having our call, our Chaos Africa weekly call tomorrow. And um, that's when it will, um, the information on uh, October 1st will likely be dropped for us. So look out for that. Um, <laughs> And let's see how each one of us can contribute in this month. Thank you. And does, does the meeting are available on the calendar? Yes, please. The meeting is available on the calendar. So um, I, let me check the calendar for the whole goal meeting so that I can put it on the doc for everyone to see. Hello, Hinon. Are you still there?
Okay, so I'm dropping the um chaos calendar in the chat session so that um in case you don't have access, you can actually check through all the meetings we usually have. Um I'm trying to okay. So here is Hogwarts. So Hogwarts Hoga will be happening uh, um, at 4 o'clock, what, West African time, so tomorrow, every Thursday. That's after the Chaos Africa community call. So let me put that on the dock. You can just then convert that to your time zone. For meetings. Okay, so our time is fast spent. Does anybody else have any question so that we don't just um sit down waiting around? Um, Busayo, do you have any um info for us as a project manager? Probably you're looking for um people from the development team that could also contribute to documentation or something. Um, I didn't really look at that before this meeting, so I currently do not have anything, but I think there would be some documentation opportunity available for people that speak um, French. So yeah, we're looking at translating some of Chaos documentations into French. So that's just like a general put out that if you can speak French, hopefully soon we'll be able to do something with that kind of documentation. But maybe by the next meeting, I'll have some documentation projects ready for contributors that want to work on documentation. Okay. Thank you very much. So someone was saying in the chat, Winifred, um, that uh, Enoch was talking about non-code uh, contributions. Yeah. So he was saying that um, if you check the repositories that we have placed the links in the doc for the devs, um, you will see that we have labeled some of these issues as documentation. So if if it's something that um, no one else has taken up and you're interested in documentation or other non-code contributions, you can actually uh, look up these issues and um, ask to be assigned to them. Does that answer your question, Winifred? And apart from documentation, um, there are also other stuff going on, like project management. Um, I think we are still... Um, let me see if Busayo can answer this question. I was still looking for um, project managers for other projects that we have at Chaos. Um, I think currently most of them are filled, but I don't know, is anybody showing interest in joining? I feel like they would always, they can always create something or make space mm -hmm. for any new joiner. So, mm -hmm. okay. if anybody is interested in joining you can just look for the project manager's channel and mm -hmm. yeah just join me. then again i would like to also encourage everyone to attend the um chaos africa now the the whole um the mother community it happens on tuesday at 5 p.m west african time um, that's where all the discussions about the different projects going on at Chaos is being discussed. So you are going to benefit a lot. You would understand um, the different 
things that are going on and where you can actually plug yourself in to contribute non-code um, contributions. I, I hope um, that answers your question, um, Winifred. Okay. Uh, okay, okay. Yes, it does. Okay. Okay. So, um, okay. Does anybody else have any question? If not, um, I think this is a good place to kind of um, see. Is anybody, somebody's raising their hands, right? Uh, let me see. Is anyone raising their hands? Because I, I peculiar. All right, go ahead, please. Yeah. Hi everyone. This is my first Hi. Um, um, I saw the list of the projects listed. I uh, Slack bots is not part of it, so I'm kind of trying to find out. Um, there are no issue to contribute so on it, or it's not part of. Please, Not could you say that again? Of... You are breaking. We can't hear you clearly. No, I said I saw the list of projects that were listed and the Slack bot is not part of it. Mm -hmm. So um, maybe that's because he did not speak out as a maintainer. Have you reached out to... Um, I'm the PM know... for the, the PM for the Slack yeah, bot. P PM stroke maintainer, yeah? Yeah. Okay, so have you reached out to Enoch to discuss about the slack bots? Okay, is that the first step? Yep, that's the first step. So you know, um, you can update the issues, do some housekeeping, uh, so that you will know what to actually um, showcase to other con uh, developers that want to contribute. But then that doesn't stop okay. us from including it here. I guess it just kept his mind because um, probably because you have not gotten together. Let me let me find the... But do you have anything for us on, on, on Slack? Well, maybe any updates since you have started working on it anyway. I never mind. I will, I will catch up with you now. Thank you. Oh, okay. Hold on, I'm trying to get this link to Slack, but in case anyone is also interested in that. Mm. Okay, I'm trying to include um, the link. Okay. All right. So, um, thank you. I've had it. We are not leaving anyone behind. <laughs> I'm sure there are still some other um development projects that we've not mentioned here. Um, um, by the time uh more housekeeping is done on those um, projects. We'll be able to put them out here so that um, people will get to know more and they know how they can contribute. But so far, these are what we have and then uh, please do check them out. Thank you. Um, let me check again. Um, Ch Chidalo, are you there? I think it's time to round off. Could you please um, take over from me? I'm not meant to facilitate. <laughs> Uh, let me see. All right. Wow. Okay. I think she dropped off again. Okay. Thank you, everyone, um, for showing up uh, again and again. So I hope that um, you are able to find your feet, you know, 
and um, enjoyed your um, contributions to chaos and to chaos Africa. Um, see you tomorrow. Yeah. And then until next week. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you, Adinka. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Um, thank you, Chidalu. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Bye.